In this video, we'll talk about producing one-way frequency tables in Stata. A one-way frequency table describes the distribution of a discrete variable. This is an example of a one-way frequency table. It describes how many respondents in a survey completed varying levels of education. The table suggests that approximately 51% of the sample finished high school only but did not move on. 13.9% completed their bachelor's degree. 6.7% finished graduate school. To create a one-way frequency table, use the command tab for tabulate. The syntax is tab space and the name of the discrete variable that you want to describe using a frequency table. For example, if I want to create a frequency table using the variable education, I type in tab space education. There are several options that you can use with the tab command. For example, if you use the option MI for missing, your table will include an additional row that counts the number of missing observations on that variable. The option no F stands for no frequency. It will tell Stata not to include counts of the number of people who responded to each category. It will only give percentages. The option no L stands for no label. It will ask Stata not to display the data labels in your variable. The option sort will ask Stata to display data in descending order of frequencies. The most common response will be listed at the top of the frequency table and the least common at the bottom. Let's see how the production of a one-way frequency table looks in a Stata session. I'll make a table for the variable sex. I type tab sex. The results give me a table showing the sample that answered male and female to the sex question. 43.6% of the sample is male, 56.4% is female. For multicotomous variables, it works the same way. Tab degree gives us the distribution of answers on the educational attainment question. Let's review. A one-way frequency table describes the distribution of a discrete variable. The syntax is tab, space, and the variable name. There are several options available with this command, including MI to create an additional row describing how many missing observations are in that variable, the, sub, or the option no F, which asks stated to suppress the frequency counts in the table, the option no L, which asks Stata to suppress the labels in that table, and the option sort, which asks Stata to display data in descending orders of frequency.